getting off to a flying start as the goal at the beginning of any group stage. Match day one coming up at the European Championship. Which team will come storming out of the traps today? Next on EA TV. Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined as always by Stuart Robson. And today it's the opening game in this particular group at the Euros. It's Georgia up against Portugal. Well, these teams know they cannot afford to drop points today. It's so important they are consistent throughout the group stages if they want to progress further in the tournament. Should be tense, Derek. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. And here's the Georgia lineup. Well, 5 3 2 only really works if your wing backs get forward every opportunity and your front two work as a pair. Let's hope they can do that today. Joao Cancelo. Fluency of movement. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. No way through. Well, they couldn't keep it. Considerable momentum, courtesy of Ronaldo. But what can he produce from here? Well, the referee wasn't going to let that go. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Promising position, this. Oh, dealt with and touched onto the frame of the goal. George Mikau Tadze. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Well, going for power from there, but not worrying the goalkeeper in the slightest. Joao Cancelo. Bruno Fernandes has it. It's with Joao Cancelo. Electing to shoot. It could be up for grabs. Otavio takes the shot. And fine goalkeeping. So the corner played into the box. Half-hearted clearance. Otavio. Is it going to be? A goal! 1-0. A fully deserved advantage based on what we've seen. When you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area, and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. So, underway again here. 1-0 the score. And the attack looks promising. But quick thinking defensively. Bruno Fernandes has it. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Otavio. And playing it through. 
Well, he tried to put everything into the shot, but couldn't find the target. Solomon Kverkvelia. And he's in. And a goal! They've added to the lead. Much needed security. Well, here it is again, and the way they've been playing, that was always going to happen. They've certainly been piling on the pressure here. And the ball is moving again. 2-0 is how it stands. Released it nicely. Well, thumped clear. An unforced error, you've got to say. Advantage played. Ota Kakabadze. And the pass deftly cut out. Otavio. And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. He skips past his marker, and that gives him the space to get his shot away. Excellent stuff from him. So the action continues, and Portugal very much bossing the proceedings here. That's a lovely ball. Safe pair of hands, did his job. Pocharashvili. A move of promise on the flank. And a decent delivery. And you need your defender to take charge. And play halted, free kick given. Cristiano Ronaldo. Good distribution. Well, he needed to read it to get there, and did. So, the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. Well, we're focusing on Cristiano Ronaldo for a reason, Stuart. Fair to say, he's been at his brilliant best. Well, the keeper will be sick at the sight of him. He's been shooting from everywhere, and he's taken his goals really well. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Well, lovely work to get past his man. And he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. And over comes the corner. Could still be dangerous. Firing it in. Oh, that surely had to go in. But marvellous defending. Well, that's common sense refereeing to play advantage. Kocharashvili. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? 
Otavio. Kiteishvili. Kakabadze. Otav Kiteishvili. Mikau Tadze. Same story. Couldn't hang on to the ball. Otar Kiteishvili. Georgi Kocharashvili. And Portugal with the ball again. Cristiano Ronaldo. Now with Silva. Otavio. On to Bruno Fernandes. Oh, he wasn't necessarily favourite to win that challenge. And we're into the final half hour. He's in behind. And a fine stop. And time for the change now. Who can they pick out? And you've just witnessed a moment of truly high-class goalkeeping. You're absolutely right. What a save that is. He's reacted so quickly. And up for grabs off the keeper. Has someone to play it to. And able to close down the shot. Great block again. Playing it in and dealing with the danger. Kiteshvili. Oh, chance perhaps. Foiling his opponent completely. Now can they counter clinically? And the referee takes exception to the challenge. Free kick. Ruben Dias distributing it well and the cross into the middle and a struggle to get it away properly just 20 minutes remaining now Bernardo Silva in a dangerous position and thumped away what a vital intervention Throw in forthcoming. No foul play, says the referee. Now to take it away. Now maybe room here for the counter attack. Can they make it count? him apparently well just look at this again the speed of counter-attack is so impressive and what a header it is from Bernardo Silva he just knows how to get on the end of crosses it's a very good goal indeed Sided contest, 4-0. Davi Tashvili. Diogo Dallo on the ball. Now maybe the really short route to go. 
Well, what a stop it was. Well, I have to say, that's a magnificent save. That's a top-class piece of goalkeeping. Delivering it. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. But on you go, says the referee. Advantage. Silva. Couldn't keep it. Diaz. It's with Joao Cancelo. And a failure to keep the ball on Portugal's part. The defender put in the challenge and it might be a red card. And it was always going to be crystal clear for the referee in terms of the decision. Well, he had to make a tackle, didn't he? Unfortunately, it wasn't a good one. Well, the footballers have an internal radar. The radar wasn't working that time. Yeah, I'm assuming he won't be taking the next one. Did well to clear it away. Well, three minutes of stoppage time added on here. Breaking at pace. Well, it was a good counter-attack in the making, but very alert defending. And the referee says that will do it. It is a win for Portugal, just what they were hoping for. Stuart, your overall assessment. You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent, full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance. Well, it truly was a fantastic performance from Bernardo Silva. Stuart, I wonder what in particular caught your eye? Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is.